The criteria to measure reliability can be timeliness and regularity. Therefore, we chose to focus on the opening hours. Since both stores were open and already in service when we arrived, both achieved high quality standards. The employee staff at the H&M outlet could easily satisfy the assurance dimension in terms of the knowledge regarding their jobs. There are a number of salesmen always around to help provide assistance, and especially when you need a specific size of clothing. The unique glow staff, however, failed to show assurance in the services provided, as when the same situation happened in unique glow and a specific size were required, it was hard for the salesmen to find where the sizes were located and what type of sizes they had. Tangible is the appearance of physical facilities, equipment, personnel, and communication materials. The condition of the physical surrounding is tangible evidence. The display products in H&M are more neat and tidy. For example, their products are clean and well categorized. They have different levels for men and women, which are very convenient for the customers. However, due to the limited number of stuff, the display products in Unicode are quite messy. For example, we saw that there were a pair of blue jeans on the ground where, which implies that the cleanness of the product are not acceptable. The individualized attention that Uniqlo showed to customers was not a quality standard. As you see in the clip, one of our customers was impatiently waiting as he was completely ignored while another was receiving care. In H&M, however, they are quick to respond to you, but also give you the individualized attention that you need. The response we received in Unique Club was very delayed. When I first tried to get our salesman attention, he was completely ignoring us while reshelving items. And when we finally did get his attention, it was a little late. However, in H&M, there was no problem with getting a salesman's attention and receiving immediate assistance.